Hey guys, it's your boy Malik on Fleek 3.0 back at it again with another anime video. And it's time. It's time. It's time for me to just destroy Darlene and Franks. Because you've seen me whenever I bring up Darlene and Franks, I always bring up one fact. And when you're watching it, when you get to episode 15 or 16, just stop right there. Don't even click the next episode just stop you're good for the rest of the day you, you just find another anime after you watch the darling and frank's episodes 1 through 16 that's it because that's that's basically the anime after that it just it goes in a dumb direction like it makes no sense so it's time for me to slander the fuck out of this show so all right so the first the first 16 15 episodes you know it felt good like the pacing was nice Zero two hero that dynamic was nice. You know, you had your third, um, that triangle because you know, Ichigo was trying to get with a hero, and that one guy that liked Ichigo wanted to, you know, stuff like that. It was a whole square right there, you know. And I thought, you know, I was like, okay, you know, I already know zero two and hero want to get together, but you know, Ichigo, you, you can keep trying. <sighs> Sorry, because like I'm already getting raised about this show. I'm gonna go with Ichigo first. My problems with this show, I'm gonna go with Ichigo. My problem with Ichigo was that she tried to force herself into Hero. No, damn, no, that he wanted to get with Zero Two. We all know that Hero wanted to get Zero Two. Matter of fact, Hero didn't look at any other female before Zero Two even came down there. Hero respected Ichigo like a sister, a best friend. Ichigo liked him. You know, you know, they didn't know the concept of kissing and stuff like that. <sighs> but what, like, it, I'm, my problem isn't with my problem with Ichigo isn't like that she tried to force herself into hero. No, 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 no. The icing on the cake was when it was when that one guy that likes Ichigo ends up being with Ichigo after the time skip. Bro, you know how much that bothered me. Because throughout the entire series, this he even confessed to her and she said, you know I love Hero. Matter of fact, the only reason she's with that one guy is because Hero and Zero Two are dead. The legit, the only reason, the only reason. Each, each go is each a hoe. Like that, that, that's the only, that's the only reason that this man even had a chance. He had to wait for his friend to die in order to get some. That's, that's pathetic. And then what makes it worse, Kokoro. Oh my God, Kokoro, bro. She did that um one fat dude so dirty, bro. Like I can never get it out of my head for the rest of my life how dirty she did. Like, how do you how do you make a promise to somebody and break it so fast? How do you make a promise? You did it in the same episode, the same episode that you made the promise, and you went with that little shit. That one guy, you know, who tried to um be thought he was better than Hero, who might have a little, who might be gay for Hero a little bit too, in the beginning. Because remember, he's like, Hero, remember when that promise that we made when we was children, you know, blah blah blah. Like this man was taking that shit personally. Like, bro, bro, chill, chill. And then he smashed Kokoro. Like that's why I thought it was so funny. Cause not only did they not know what sex was. He he did it once. She was already impregnated. She didn't even wait till she was sixteen and pregnant. Did it while she was fifteen. Like, like there were so many problems I had with this show after episode fifteen and sixteen. Like this show wanted so bad to be like Gurren Lagann. This show really wanted to be like Gurren Lagann. Like, the, like Darling and Franks episodes one to fifteen and sixteen. You know, I just I said in the beginning, it was so good. Like you, you was interested, you was intrigued. Hey, um, hero meets this um, boy meets girl. You know, now they're fighting evil. You know, they're trying to find themselves. Like that's interesting. But they decide to not only potato zero two like she was Kirito, or put her in that rim sleep. Not only did they do that. They made it into a fucking ship. But, like, 
I say it's like Gurren Lagann because they did like this. One, remember Gurren Lagann, um, ah, I forgot her name, forgot her name. The girl that, uh, Simon loved, the one that he ends, he ends up with, she disappears. She's taken by aliens. Zero two. She's taken by aliens, but she's um, become the ship to fight the aliens. You know, a little bit different. Same difference. Um, hero Simon. Um, they both go into space to save said their female, their heroine. All right, everybody goes in. Somehow the machines that they have, you know, works in space. Okay. They both have time skips, even though Gil Lagan's time skip makes more sense than Darlene and Frank's. Like, they just slapped the time skip with everybody there and had Zero Two and Hero still fighting in space for like years without even aging. Everybody else aged but Hero and Zero Two. Okay. Oh, what happened? Gil Lagan, um, what's her face, died? After they were, they went so far to save everybody, um, to save her. Okay, zero two and hero died. Like, how are you gonna kill off likable people? Like, I, 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 you already know that I, I love zero two. I love her. I love her with passion. I actually like hero. Hero didn't really make me angry in this show at all. Like, I had no problems with him. Everybody else in the show, I didn't like. Like. Hero 2 and Zero Hero Hero and Zero 2 were the only two people in that show that were like That was it. That was it. Everybody else was trash. Everybody else was trash. Except for the guy that I like Ichigo. But you know He had to he had to come in second place. Like I actually feel bad for him. Like imagine imagine you've been trying to get with somebody for so long and the only reason they get with you because your best friend died. Like I just, it just you can't get out of your, my mind. I can't get out of my mind. This show wanted to be Garen Lagan so bad at the end. After episode, like you know, I knew this show was about to go downhill. It's when Kokoro and that one dude were trying to get married. Like, are you serious? Like Hero and Zero Two didn't even get married. They make more sense of getting married because they were with each other the longest. But you had Kokoro get married okay and it and not only that they brought people that who were um oh, i forgot what they were supposed to be they were supposed to be like zero two but you know they weren't the best experiments they're like they were the best out of the bunch but they're not like zero two because they were trying to make them like zero two and they decided to come out of nowhere like when 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 was this how and then and then you Aliens, like I was already fine with the um the monsters that was on Earth, bro. I was already fine because it made sense. You're fighting. You did not have to humanize them. Like not only did you, oh, we're all together now. Like oh, let's you know, let's be friends and fight the actual alien enemy. Like really, where did the aliens come from? Like they um darling Franks is acting like oh we set this up from the beginning no the fuck you didn't bro because i would have saw it coming because when i was watching i'm like yo 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 when the aliens were introduced like okay if you said oh um the, the monsters that was on earth that was fighting everybody hero and zero two oh they're um zero two is exactly like them see i can buy that i can buy that see it would have made the plot interesting it made the plot interesting I'm like, oh Zero Two is fighting her own kind, you know. You know she's half, but she, it's still she's still fighting her own kind. Oh, that makes sense. That's interesting. But when I just sorry, like I just I can't. I have no words for this show. Like you really, you this is how you fuck up a show. Like when you try to do too much. Like really. Like seriously. You you was doing too much. Like you, episodes one through fifteen, bro. I can't stress it enough. Like it was so good. You was invested. Like you loved the show. And like on 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 God, if it just ended right there, episode fifteen and sixteen, bro, you would have been so you would been happy. Like you've been good. You would have been good. But you was like, oh, 
it's a 24 um, episode season you know i wonder what these last couple episodes are gonna be like and it will be the worst episodes you'll see in your entire life like how the fuck do you make your waifu a fucking ship like you like i want to find who made that decision and just punch the shit out of him because you made zero two the most beautiful girl on the show is ship ichigo and kokoho they're the worst characters like oh my god but i got i hope you like this um video hope you like and subscribe and if you watch darling frames remember only one through 15 bro that's all i can stress enough for you only one through 15 and like i just can't stress it enough just watch those and you'll understand what i'm talking about if you if you have the balls to even go past episode 15 and 16 bro you're going to be disappointed we're going to fleet 3.0 out